Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is going to be a quick video to show you how to connect to services running locally from your self-hosted Docker instance. So this could be services such as APIs or databases that could be running as Docker containers or on your host directly. So I'm going to be showing you how to connect to them from your self-hosted AppSmith instance. So taking a look at what we have here on the screen, I have this application running on my local self-hosted AppSmith instance. And what I want to do is connect this to an API server I have running locally. So let's go create an API for this. And I'm just going to quickly switch over to VS Code so that I can show you the server I have running. So let's go to VS Code. And as you can see, I have a simple express hello world application that's written in node.js so i can start the server by typing node index.js or server.js all right and this starts off the server on port 8080 so we can go over to the browser and take a look at what we have running on that port so this is localhost 8080 and it says hello from whatever the host name is right here this is fine but the problem with this is that i cannot go ahead to copy this for example and use that right here in the get request. So if I go ahead to run this, for example, it's not going to work. And that's because Docker really does not know what localhost is. So to fix this, we have to change the host name to something Docker understands. So we have to change the host name instead of using localhost. This is going to be host.docker.internal, which actually bridges um, the container where AppSynth is running to the host machine, and then it's able to access whatever is running on port um, 8080. So if I go run this now, you can see that we're able to connect to the process running on my host from the Docker container by using this um, new host that is right here. And you can see we have the response saying that the service was actually running on my host machine. But what if it's the other way around? I need to connect to a service that is running as a Docker container. How do I go about doing that? So let me show you that real quick. So let's head back to VS Code. I'm going to stop um, the server I have running on my host. And I also have the server packaged as a Docker container. This is the Docker Compose for it. So I'm just going to start this up with uh, Docker Compose op-d, for example and it's going to start off this server as a docker container. So how do I connect to it? Well, I don't need to do anything different. All I still need to do is type in host.docker.internal and then the port where I have the server running, which in this case, it's the same port. So I really don't have to change anything when it comes to the URL. So I'm just going to go ahead to run this and you can see that we have the response from the Docker container where I have the server running. Now it says hello, but from this hash, which is the host name of whatever container it's running in. So this is how easy it is to connect to services, which could be running as um, Docker containers or on the host itself. All you need to do is just supply host the Docker the internal, and then you can connect to whatever APIs server you have or whatever databases you want to connect to. All right, that'll be all for today's video. See, I see you next time. Take care of yourself and don't forget to get subscribed. Bye-bye.